Coast Salish Development Corporation has emerged as a new economic force on central Vancouver Island. The Coast Salish have stepped in in a leadership role in economic development of our region, and we're seeing a lot of positive growth. The changes here have been dramatic. Tasked with leading this Dominus First Nation to self-sufficiency through economic development, Coast Salish Development Corporation, or CSDC, has become a significant economic driver in the region. Economic development for Staminas is a driving force of change. It's going to be huge for the future. They've changed the landscape, surely, and uh, they've created a future uh, for their community, for their people, and it's been an amazing transition from what you see on the highway. I mean, this is just the tip of the iceberg. People see this and go, oh, they're doing stuff, but they've been doing stuff for seven years. Um, and there's a lot of other things that they have embarked on. CSDC is gaining momentum, bringing growth through economic planning and sound business management. We are creating win-win partnerships and major joint ventures with private industry and the Crown. We want to do some business at the speed of business. Uh, historically, First Nations have not been in a position to do that, but we have created a business model that will allow us to do that. In terms of uh, doing business with the Coast Salish Economic Development Corporation, I can say that it has been not only a pleasure, but it has been a very strong, very corporate relationship that's built on a foundation of trust and um, mutual benefit. And uh, working together, we were amazed at how quickly the, the, build, the decision was made, the lease was signed, the building went up, and all of a sudden it's like, we want you to move in, we're ready to go. As a nation, we've worked hard to prove ourselves that we are ready to be in business. Our award-winning portfolio of companies spans many sectors, creating a diversified economy for the Staminas First Nation. This includes forestry, real estate development, construction, petroleum services, property management, liquefied natural gas storage, aquaculture, and fisheries. The goal in every economic initiative that CSDC pursues is to achieve the highest and best use for Staminas assets and ensure long-term social benefits. CSDC is building a bright future for Staminas, and today there are many opportunities to be a part of that future. Oyster Bay Development, the cornerstone of CSDC's economic development activities, is located on Staminas Reserve alongside the Trans-Canada Highway. This 65-acre master-planned community is growing into a vibrant hub for tourism, commercial, assisted living and residential development in the region. A first-class development springing up out of the ground here. Featuring five major multinational companies and many local businesses, the commercial area is growing quickly. Already, Tim Hortons, Esso, Husky, A&W, and the new Microtel Inn & Suites by Wyndham, currently under construction, are located at the heart of Oyster Bay. The Microtel Inn & Suites by Wyndham at Oyster Bay will feature 82 uh, rooms and suites. So Microtel differentiates itself amongst its competitors by providing the most modern hotel concept in the industry. That includes great internet, brand new TVs, pool and hot tub, all at a great price. And we are anticipating tremendous growth in the next 12 to 18 months. We think we'll do very well at this site. Our agreement with Tim's caters to our model of not being land leasers. We want it to be owners and partners. So for us, the Tim Hortons revenue sharing agreement, you know, is kind of a big deal. We want to be a true partner or a true owner of many of these businesses that we are creating. Oyster Bay Development has land dedicated for residential and assisted living opportunities. We envision an inviting, centrally located community with modern amenities where families thrive and seniors find all levels of support they need. Seriously looking at somewhere between 200 and 400 units as far as assisted living is concerned. Coast Salish Development Corporation is seeking partners to make this goal a reality. Oyster Bay's location is ideal. We've got a very good highway access point so it's a great opportunity for our customers to find easier access to our business. 
We have 30,000 cars that come by here every day. We're really proud to be part of the, uh, the Oyster Bay uh, development. It's a great strategic location in the middle of Vancouver Island. Really excited about the, the opportunity to be involved in Oyster Bay uh, and the partnership that we have with the Coast Salish Development Corporation. Our successes are the result of years of strategic planning. Through planning, we have created a solid foundation for future growth, and it's on this foundation that development at Oyster Bay has become a reality. But building a new town from scratch presents many challenges. It requires funding, planning, infrastructure, and establishing municipal processes. We have already put in place a $3.2 million water and sewer system at Oyster Bay and signed a water and sewer agreement with the town of Ladysmith, providing reliable services and accommodating future growth. We made a commitment to fund some infrastructure some basic infrastructure and they delivered flawlessly. We have created a streamlined municipal structure making it easy for developers and entrepreneurs to do business here. The Coast Salish Development Corporation, they're first class people to work with. With these foundations in place and another 60 acres remaining to be developed, Oyster Bay will continue to grow and provide development opportunities for many years to come. Over the last seven years, CSDC has been building on each successive accomplishment. Our growth is opening up new opportunities and new jobs, today and for the future. Coast Salish Development Corporation is going to create those opportunities uh, around uh, employment, around jobs that are meaningful for Staminas members, and not only for Staminas, but creating opportunities for uh, so many other people. In the last five years, we've created roughly 100 jobs, um, a lot of that being in the service industry. Uh, the real impact on jobs is going to be over the next 10 years. Uh, we anticipate, you know, through our economic development planning, that we're going to create at least 600 jobs. With increased employment and entrepreneurial opportunities, we can see financial and social benefits for our region, as well as a growing sense of pride in the community. Building relationships and partnerships are key components in Coast Salish development success. We uh, want to build relationships, we want to build partnerships. This is about all of us coming together. We're very new at this, but we're proud to be part of building it with you and having those opportunities for in the future to make sure that we continue to grow. My relationship with the leadership and with the Economic Development Corporation is nothing but positive. Very happy to collaborate because this is um, a sustainable uh, and low-risk environment to operate in. We're looking for partnerships that cater to our strengths. Uh, we also are aware, you know, of our capacity gaps, and so we look, you know, for partners that can fill those gaps. And we're also looking for partners that, you know, that have similar philosophies around business. We look for longer-term type opportunities. The Coast Salish Development Corporation has done a wonderful job and extremely happy to be partnered up with them. You know, as a nation, I think we uh, have come a long ways and we want to be good partners in what we do. We seek partnerships that are true to Staminas values and that are built on mutual respect and trust. We formed a, a very quick partnership because we realized that we had the same vision. That relationship is, again, based on trust and it's based on shared values. We really look at the relationship with the Coast Salish Development Corporation as a long-term partnership. Uh, we're excited to be in business together. We have a very positive relationship with the Stuminas First Nations. We look forward to working with the Stuminas First Nation community into the future. In 2012, CSDC entered into a partnership with Fortis, BC in the Mount Hayes Liquefied Natural Gas Storage Facility. This $200 million award-winning project provided employment for Staminas members and with 7.5% ownership, it will provide revenue for years to come. Deer Point was established uh, in conjunction with the LNG opportunity. We had uh, close to $10 million in direct award contracts. So in the future, Deer Point will emerge as a major construction force in the area. 
Coast Salish Development's forestry arm, Pithicut Resources, manages 1,600 hectares of forest land and continues to acquire additional forestry lands. The land is used for timber harvests today and may be rezoned for commercial and residential development in the future. It's going to lead to other expansion opportunities. There's uh, lots of opportunities for us uh, to partner up with forest companies and actually other First Nations to take advantage of those forestry opportunities. Our partnership in the Holland Creek development is an excellent example of this type of development and achieves the highest and best use of Staminas First Nation owned lands. Construction on this 600 unit residential development in the town of Ladysmith is underway. The project will create jobs and revenue for the next seven to 10 years. New residents will increase demand for goods and services in the region, creating broad economic benefits. Other strategic partnerships include an exploration agreement for a copper and gold mine with RCR Mining, or our most exciting new partnership, an 83% ownership stake in the new 81-room Microtel Inn & Suites by Wyndham, developed in partnership with Masterbuilt Hotels. The hotel for us is huge. That has been a big opportunity for us that we're, you know, we're really kind of waiting for that to happen. It'll be a big thing for the community as well. Some of the most important assets CSDC has developed are its relationships. Coast Salish Development has worked to foster strong ties with industry, organizations, and all levels of government, including establishing agreements or MOUs with the town of Ladysmith, the Nanaimo Airport, and Timber West. In 2012, they signed a memorandum of understanding as part of a community accord between Staminas and Ladysmith that we're very proud of. The relationship is really the key underpinning for that. The memorandum of understanding helps build a collaborative relationship between the Staminas First Nations and the Nanaimo Airport Commission. The Staminas First Nations and the Nanaimo Airport Commission have unique goals and aspirations, but we can work together to have win-win scenarios. We can't do it alone, we understand that. We need to work together and build a future for so many others and build a future for our children. People start to see the success of Oyster Bay or the waterfront development projects that we're working on now. Um, really gives people a, a comfort and an excitement about the opportunities that can only be uh, realized through that partnership. Perhaps our most important relationship is with our community. CSDC's responsibility to the community goes beyond profit. We want to do business in a responsible way and in a sustainable way. Our community is proud of the fact that we are following the triple bottom line. It is the community's vision that guides our activities. CSDC is not just a profitable enterprise, it is a social enterprise that exists for the benefit of the Staminas First Nation. Our community understands that our businesses need to grow, but we also understand that our communities need to grow as well. We distribute 20% of our annual profits back to the community. They just support all this progress. They're always asking questions on, you know, what's next, what's happening. They really have um, been waiting a long time for this to happen to in, in our community and they're very, very excited. They want to be part of the growth. They want to see more opportunities for our people. And the excitement of the community is uh, overwhelming. We're now in a position that we put ourselves where we can create these opportunities. Coast Salish Development is building a strong, sustainable economy and bright future for Staminas. The First Nation here will prosper in a sustainable way, but they're bringing um, regional economic opportunities to this whole area. The future potential is really only limited by our imagination. We're really focused on making the Microtel and Suites by Wyndham a, a big success. Uh, we'd love to do more business together in the future. We've got great momentum. It's exciting. It's a good time to be part of Lady Smith and Staminas for sure. Today, there exists a tremendous opportunity to be part of this future. One of our biggest assets is land. For developers, we have lands that are ready for building with solid infrastructure in place. At Oyster Bay, we have serviced commercial lots ranging from one to three acres, suitable for drive-through restaurants, office buildings, retail, auto use, and more. 
This solid commercial backbone sets the stage for residential and assisted living developments of all sizes. Single-family subdivisions, multi-family developments, or high-end waterfront retirement communities. Off-reserve, we have residential development land at Holland Creek, a marina site in Ladysmith Harbor, or light industrial and business park land in South Ladysmith. And everybody has an opportunity to be involved in the success that we are creating in Oyster Bay and in our territory. It's going to be a big future for not only the families in my community, but so many other families and other communities. CSDC is seeking more partnerships in resource development, forestry and wood fiber, LNG and renewable energy, aquaculture and fisheries, minerals and water. We have companies already operating in these sectors and we have proven success in business. Today, First Nations in BC are becoming major players in the Canadian economy. With undeveloped land and access to resources, the opportunities are almost endless. Coast Salish Development Corporation is among the most successful examples of Aboriginal economic development, and we are excited to play a part in Stamina's First Nations' bright future.